Hello everybody and welcome back to another one of these bi-weekly Sunday vlog things. Not much really to report on this go around. However, have you guys been enjoying the like two videos a day thing that I was able to do? Yeah, that's not gonna happen. That was that that's not gonna happen regularly, I should say. I'm gonna stick to the whole at one video a day uh, setting right now coming out at about three o'clock I still don't know why I picked three o'clock of all the times to go with but for right now that's basically just what's gonna happen um, not really hard a whole lot of input on the whole intro outro thing so I'm gonna keep going with what I've done I kind of like what I've done I did get one comment which I'm not for sure was like a spam comment or something like that. Um, guys asking me, hey, do you want music? Sub to us and then we'll help you out with music and stuff. And, um, no, I can find royalty free music that works for me pretty easily. In fact, it's probably what I've got going on right now as we're doing this. Other than that, um, I have enjoyed Minecraft Story Mode. I've started up, I actually just wrapped up recording, um, going through and changing, not changing, but um, I did it in a different save file, but seeing like what all the different options would do, because apparently there were like five main options of go this way and your story will become different or something like that, and so even though I was in the minority for the first one, I did the majority on the second playthrough just to see what if anything is different and I mean I've gone over this little rant before of how the choose your own adventure games for the most part really aren't choosing your own adventure kind of a thing just because they want the story to play out a certain way so no matter what you do it's always going to end up back at the same point you're going to start at the same point, which all stories have a beginning, and let's just face it, a beginning is a beginning. You're not going to make any change there to make the beginning any different. But the end, for the most part on these Choose Your Own Adventures, are always going to end the exact same. I've played through the Season 1 of The Walking Dead several times, and every single time, spoiler, go check out my video, or go check out the playlist that I did on that one, if you don't want the spoiler for it, you've got a couple of seconds, annotations on the screen, descriptions down below and links for those of you on pocket devices. Uh, if I think about it, I'll also throw it up on a card real quick so you can even poke that. But I'm giving you a fair warning, I'm giving you a chance, this is your spoiler alert. Um, three, two, one, okay, time's up. But yeah, I've played through many times on that and every single time the exact same thing happened Lee dies in the end which sucks you spend all this time all this effort putting forth getting that character to the point and he still dies I mean yeah the second journey was a little bit different there were some other things that I didn't experience before but I mean it was mainly dialogue dialogue whatever it was mainly dialogue just like the words that they chose to spoke were different like I may have heard an extra bit over here because I did something because I uh, chose to pick up something or I saw something glinty and picked it up but I mean seriously the game plays exactly the same every single time you go through the exact same motions every single time and that was one of my biggest complaints with it And I mean I tried doing something this time in um, my replay through Minecraft story mode, seeing if I could get anything different, seeing if I could find some place where the story diverges, some place where it's not forcing you to go through the exact same steps, and I couldn't. I didn't see anything of where it would let me do something else. So yeah, that's my big complaint there. Uh, what else? Anything new on any other fronts? Not really. I mean, life's pretty much still been chill. Uh, got into an argument. Argument? Got into a discussion. I'm not going to call it an argument. Got into a discussion with a friend of mine the other day that um, I will applaud him for. He sticks to his guns even when 
all evidence is presented to him showing him that he is 100% wrong, he'll stay to what he said. So, bravo for not faltering on that, my friend. And if you're watching this, which I seriously doubt you are because I don't even think you know I have a YouTube channel, um, yeah, you know who you are. Good job. But yeah, we were in a discussion over some comic book movie stuff. And let's just leave it at that. Oh, let's think what else. Nope. I mean, yeah. Life's been pretty chill. There is someone walking very close to my backyard. He's not in my backyard, but he's walking very close to the fence of my backyard. Anyway, so yeah, I mean, that's pretty much everything that's going on here. If you got something that you want to see me play, let me know. I'm probably gonna, because they are putting out the final episode to another Telltale game that I have in my uh, games list that I'm probably going to go ahead and start playing. It's really fun. I've purposefully not watched, just like with Minecraft Story Mode, I've purposely not watched other people playing it, so I don't know what to expect, and so it is a genuine response of things to me. Um, yeah, other than that, stay tuned. Oh yeah, I was going to say that. I did have something. I need, really need to write stuff down when I start thinking and talking about stuff. Um, I was going to say, I'm probably going to either take a break from or stop playing completely Dishonored for a couple of reasons. Number one, I've kind of lost interest in it. The game itself got has gotten very repetitive, and I mean, it is incredibly punishing for someone just playing it. Now, if I spent like all my time crouched down in the shadows and spent like 15 to 30 minutes a session specifically avoiding people it's gonna be really really boring gameplay for you guys um, but it's at the same time I could get like a really really good specific ending if I went that way however just playing through it I've got like this incredibly ridiculously high chaos rating which I was looking into and the chaos means that the game actually gets harder because there gets more bots, there gets more zombies, there gets more guards and all this stuff and I'm like, I've been trying not and it's like I will slip up and make one thing and all of a sudden there's like 30 guys around me that I have to fight my way out of. I guess I could run, but at the same time, if I run, then they start throwing things and shooting at me and all this stuff, and I end up running into, like, these insta-death walls and all this stuff, and so it's just not... It's, it's, it's very punishing. It's very punishing if you don't play in a very specific manner. So, yeah. I'm probably going to either take a break or completely stop. I'm not for sure how much further I've got to go. Uh, I think I've got that. I think I think the last thing I did was like get all my gear back, and which I thought was going to be an escort quest, but instead I got like supremely drugged and stuff. So yeah, that was fun. And then they took all my stuff from me, and someone I'm pretty sure sucker punched me while I was blacked out because I woke up with this incredible pain in my stomach. The meat, not the actual character Corvo, but I'm just saying it's transferred. Never mind. Um, so, yeah. Um, if you want to see me continue Dishonored, go ahead and put that down in the description. Otherwise, I'm going to take a break and start doing some other stuff. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it for now. Uh, so, thanks for joining me, and I will catch you guys next time. Bye! Hello, everybody, and welcome to the outro. Well, you know what to do. If you want to leave a comment, there's a whole big listing down there for you to write what you thought about it. If you want to like that video and let your other friends know that you like it, if you want to share me around, go right ahead. I won't stop you. There's even a little button for that down there. And if you think you can put up with me again, there's another button for you called subscribe. Go ahead and hit that. We can go on this entire journey together. Well, that's it for me. I'll catch you guys next time. How do I turn this thing off?